Do you know Mississauga has three beautiful beaches that are easily accessible and free? Hello, this is Sonia, your local realtor with Remax Realty Specialist, bringing you everything in and about Greater Toronto area and real estate. One thing in common is all of these beaches are on Lake Ontario. All of them do have the kids play area or splash pads and has a lot of picnic areas with tons of shaded trees. One thing to remember is that these beaches are unsupervised means there are no lifeguards present so swim at your own risk. So let's enjoy these beaches. Number one on my list is Jack Darling Memorial Park Beach. Jack Darling Memorial Park is one of the most popular parks in Mississauga and for good reason. Not only does it have a great beach, it also has a long list of amenities that draw residents in droves. The beach here is divided into two sections with one area much nicer than the other. As you wander down in the trails from the parking lot, the best beach will be off your left. This pleasant stretch of sand is sandwiched in two small rocky headlands which provide some protection from westerly and easterly winds. If the winds are out of the south, you will have a bit of surf to play in, so bring your water toys. The sand is soft and golden brown and just about perfect for creating sandcastles masterpieces. Sit up on the beach with your umbrella and towel and enjoy the views out there over Lake Ontario. Later on, stroll up to the grassy areas in behind and enjoy a picnic under the trees. The beach has clean, clear water and is great for swimming and splashing about. Swimmers take note that the beach has a gradual incline and stays shallow for a fair way out. This allows it to warm up a bit from Lake Ontario's often bone-chilling temperatures and also making it ideal for wading with small children. The second beach off the right is much smaller and narrower but equally as pleasant. A bit more exposed than the other beach here, you will find larger waves suitable for strong swimmers. If the kids find the lake water too cold or are looking for a bit more activity, a large splash pad is located just back from the beach. Beyond that, an extensive playground is available. Although dogs are not permitted on the beach, the park has an absolutely huge off-leash area that is not to be missed. Parking at Jack Darling Memorial Park on hot summer weekends is at a premium. If you want to get a spot near the beach, be sure to arrive before 10 a.m. or be prepared for a long walk. Number two is Richards Memorial Park Beach. Richard Memorial Park Beach has an excellent beach and is lesser known than its fleshier counterpart Jack Darling Park just down the road. However, for those in the know, this is just fine because many people feel the beach here is actually better. Backed by towering trees and open green space, the beach at Richards Memorial Park is a quiet and relaxing place to enjoy the waters of Lake Ontario. The beach is divided into two main sections with a small headland in between. The beach on the right as you face the lake is small, cozy and well protected. The sand is soft and you can choose to set up there or if you prefer shade just back under the trees. The beach of the left is larger and is backed by wild rose shrubs and trees. There is more room here to toss a frisbee or have a large beach gathering. This is a beach with a little bit more action but still pretty quiet when compared to one of Toronto's beaches like Woodbine. Richards Memorial Park Beach has large green spaces and a great playground for the kids. If you need a break from the sun, wander around to the monument dedicated to peace on earth. And number three is Lakefront Promenade Park Beach. Boasting Mississauga's largest beach, Lakefront Promenade Park has everything for a great day on the water. Unlike Mississauga's other beaches, this man-made swimming area is set back from Lake Ontario, shaped in the form of an upside-down L. Water from Lake Ontario comes into a protected inland that is surrounded on all sides by sand. It's this shape and protection from the large lake that makes the beach at Lakefront Promenade the best place in Mississauga for stand-up paddle boarding and kayaking. Bring all your water toys, the shallow calm water and easy launching from the beach makes paddling here a player. 
The beach is made of a coarse sand which is not as nice as natural lake fronting Lake Ontario. However, the trade-off is that the water here is relatively shallow and warms up to a pleasant temperature. The beach is huge so finding a spot is never an issue. The, the best place to park is in parking lot number 4. A walking and biking trail, part of the waterfront trails run along the northern side of the beach where you will also find washrooms. There is a splash bed located near the baseball diamond on the north end of the park along with a playground. If you have a powered watercraft, a great boat launch is located in the park. Be sure to take a walk out on the headlands of parking lot number 5. You will be treated to spectacular lake views with the Toronto skyline off in the distance. Thanks for watching and don't forget to join me next week. Until then, stay happy and stay safe.